Hey everyone, it's another 30 Days of WrestleMania. WrestleMania 27. I'm Mike Sorgat, Sorgatron on, on the Twitters for WrestlingMayhemShow.com. And like I said, the WrestleMania 27 this year, um, this was a fun one. Uh, there, this is the start of, you know, we had the Shawn Michaels uh, situation happening. And uh, I, they kind of continued things a little bit. Uh, of course, The Rock, also the part of what I, I like to think is a three-year storyline for WrestleMania. Uh, with The Rock hosting, uh, and of course leading to The Miz and John Cena at the end, uh, and what transpired there. Uh, mixed bag, of course, we had Michael Cole against Jerry Lawler, which was weird. And I forgot how much I absolutely hated the Raw general manager. Uh, anonymous general manager so there's that as well but still uh other than that i i think another highlight of course is uh uh you know undertaker and triple h again like i love these storylines that are are very much wrestlemania to wrestlemania um you know in that in in the case of of, of undertaker triple h and really the entire thing of Shawn michaels to triple h to undertaker triple h um is like a four-year storyline and seeing that culmination come up which we'll talk about next show but even just seeing the beginnings of this and knowing where it leads uh kind of you see the full picture whereas at the time maybe we don't see it all when we're going week to week on on you know from wrestlemania to wrestlemania from raw to raw and we'll look back and say wow they didn't they painted an arc that lasted three years um and I think that's that's really interesting and really important to kind of acknowledge that. Um, as far as what else happened in there, um, can I put this one out there, guys? Can we get Snooki uh, in the celebrity wing of the Hall of Fame? Because I think after that performance, she really kind of deserves it. Um, really pulling out athleticism that nobody expected from this one. Um, yeah, she pulled a couple moves, but honestly, she did a little bit more than Arnold Schwarzenegger did, um, and brought some attention to it. And I, you know, uh, it was it was interesting. It was really interesting, actually. And I remember being surprised by that the first time we saw this. Um, also interesting, uh, you know, Trish Stratus is part of this, and uh, of course, uh, Stone Cold and Booker T as part of the uh, 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 Michael Cole and Jerry Lawler match. Oh, the coal mine with the uh, with the, the the clear case coal mine that he was in was was hilarious. Um, but again, we thought I was stuck at the time because we were going uh, week to week. But uh, still, tough enough was going on at the time. And that's another thing is you kind of see these initiatives going on uh, around these these eras, and you're like, oh, this is the time we had a tough enough. This is the time where we had ECW, you know. Um, and you get to see kind of the shape of it. There was a passing mention, uh, I think around WrestleMania 20 or maybe a little bit earlier for XFL. And I just kind of laughed at myself and moved on. Um, anyways, uh, so WrestleMania 27, hosted by The Rock. Let me know what you think about it. Uh, what's your thoughts of it, your memories, wherever you watched it. Maybe you were there. Let me know. Uh, let me know at Sorgatron on the Twitter. At Mayhem Show is the Twitter for the Wrestling Mayhem Show. And check out all the other stuff at WrestlingMayhemShow.com and the other 30 Days of WrestleMania videos. Subscribe to YouTube and check out all that stuff and anything else we come up with after WrestleMania. See you next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.